Hi YouTube, I'm back and I'd like to share with you a Bath and Body Works semi-annual sale haul that I did. But first I'd like to welcome back all of my current subscribers and welcome all of the new subscribers um, to my channel. Thank you for taking the time to watch my video and I hope that you are inspired in some way, form, or fashion to, you know, go out here and shop and get these good deals. All right, so I went to two separate Bath & Body Works. I had watched several videos. I watched uh, Myra, Plus, Myra and Kyla. I watched um, in and l I watched Philly Candleman. I mean, uh, Hearth and Soul. I mean, the list goes on of all these people. And if you're in the candle community, you you know everybody that I just named. So I've been watching videos and people have been doing Bath and Body Works hauls. And so it was a couple of things that I saw that I really wanted to try, especially as far as candles. But I, I don't mean any harm. My Bath and Body Works, the two that I went to, their candle selection was just not what I was expecting. But, um, and one of the stores I went into, the manager, she said, you know, we'll, you know, we're putting different things out, you know, throughout the sale. And I'm like, so that means I'm going to have to keep coming back and forth, but it's okay. <laughs> it's fine. Um, but I did get a few things. I didn't buy as many candles as I would like to have purchased, but I did get some body products and I will share all of those things with you. So let me move these bags out of the way and we will get right on into the haul um the first thing i'll do is i'll share the body products that i got with you um and the first thing i got was these fresh towel body cleansing towelettes on the go um and you get 12 sheets and i saw teresa t for two she hauled these and um i said gosh i really I really want to try those. So their regular price on these were $16.50 and they were 75% off. Everything I got was 75% off. All right. The next thing I picked up was uh, Finish Smooth in the Shower Body Lotion. And the regular price on this was $16.50. I also picked up this um, Sport Sunscreen Mist. And the regular price on that was $16.50. I picked up three of these Hand Heroes. Well, the regular price on these were $14.50. They had a, um, a sample in the store where you could try. And when I put that stuff on my hands, it left them feeling so soft and smooth. And it has a nice little, I guess kind of citrusy smell to it. A little bit it's like a hint of something and it smells really good so I picked up three of those because I thought I said you know my if I like it my mom will probably really like that because she's always you know using lotion and things like that on her hands so she would love something like that so I um so I got one of those for her as well and then I picked up the hit restart activated charcoal gel cleanser now my husband loves the charcoal products that are out now you know that a lot of people are buying the charcoal mask and the body um washes and things like that he's into all of that so when i saw that those were 75 percent off i grabbed two and the regular price on these were if we can get the glare out 13.50 all right and then i saw let me see Teresa T for two, she hauled the rose water body milk. And I was kind of skeptical about getting it because it looks kind of, you know, like it's kind of thin, like, you know how sometimes lotion can have like kind of thin, but it smelled so good. I went ahead and grabbed it and I, I really like it. It smells really good. And I, they had a, a tester in the store. And it's not, it looks thin, but it's not, it doesn't feel too thin going on. 
All right. Um, I picked up the Amber and Argan body creams for two of my daughters. Um, Myla and Maddie. They like the body creams and they were regular price $13.50. And then I picked up um, two of these. They were 75% off as well. The Sleep, the Lavender and Cedarwood, and the Focus, the Eucalyptus and Tea. I picked up this one for myself. And then I picked up the Sleep lavender and cedarwood for my daughter Kyla. She loves on um, the sleep line that they have. And the regular price on these were $16.50. Alright, I picked up a strawberry vanilla body cream. Regular $13. It was, I think, $3.95. It was in the $3.95 bin. And then I picked up the Country Apple, the Mist, and the Body Cream. I love this fragrance. This is an oldie but goodie. And this was regular $14. And this was regular, well, if you can see it, $13. I love those apple scents, especially in the fall of the year. Okay, and then I picked up the Fine Fragrance Mist in Spice Pumpkin Cider. And the regular price on this was $13.50. And then I picked up the body cream, which this was the only one that I saw. Spice Pumpkin Cider body cream. And let's see. The regular price on that was $6. All right, then I grabbed some of their mask for a dollar fifty cent. I grabbed two of these. Keep it fruity papaya and tea extracts face sheet mask. I grabbed one totally terrific face sheet mask tea tree oil licorice and root extract. And then I grabbed four of these. If you Shea so. Shea butter with jojoba oil. And they were regular price $4.95, but they won't sell for $1.50. All right. So that was everything that I got in body products. Now, on to the candles that I picked up. And uh, like I said, I really, the candles, but I did get some of the ones that I wanted. I was just hoping to be able to pick up a whole lot more, but the sale goes on through July. So hopefully, um, as time go on, you know, there may be some others that they put out that I can grab that I really like. The first one that I got is I grabbed two of these. Summertime Soda Pop. <clears throat> I first saw this candle on Myra and Kyla's video, they hauled this candle. And um, I was intrigued by it. And um, let's see. The scent notes are crisp lime, zesty lemon, and splash of soda. I love the way they smell. You definitely get that effervescence of like a soda. And it smells so good. And the packaging, to me, is so fun. I love that. That is going to be fun to burn over the summer. So I got two of those. The next one I picked up was the Root Beer Float. And here are the scent notes. Root Beer, Vanilla Ice Cream, Dollop of Whipped Cream. And to be honest with you, this smells just like an A&W Root Beer. It smells really good. I love the way it smells. It's going to be something fun. You know, it's a fun scent, I think, to burn. The next one I picked up was Paris Cafe. If you like coffee scents, you'd like this one. Um, the scent notes are rich roasted coffee, 
sugared brioche and vanilla cream. This smells just like a coffee. And I'm I'm going to give this one to my husband because he loves coffee scents too. So he'll be excited to get this candle. And the last one that I picked up was Campfire Donut. <laughs> um, this is an all-time just good smelling candle. I love anything that has donut on it. <laughs> so let's look at the scent notes. It's... Um, made with notes of powdered sugar glazed donut and cedarwood essential oils i love the way this smell it has a, a sweetness to it and um i only saw this one i did i only saw this one so i'm hoping that they have more somewhere because i wouldn't mind picking up a couple of more of these so that was my Bath and Body Works semi-annual sale haul round one. Um, like I said, I'll be peeking my head back and forth in there to see if there's anything else that I want. Um, I, like I mentioned earlier, I really would like to get more candles if they have some scents that I really want. Um, but I'll just keep a check just to see you know, what they have. So I would like to thank you for watching this video. Um, if you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe. And I will see you all in my next video. Now I have done, just for those who are curious, I have done a Yankee Candle Haul. I've done two of those since, the, since their SAS has started. But I have put that on my Instagram page. And my Instagram is creative Ms. Alicia at Creative Ms. Alicia, M R S Alicia. Now you can go over there and see what I picked up from Yankee, and um, I may peek my head back in Yankee this week. I don't know what to say about the Yankee SAS sale. I I was able to find some stuff when I did shop, but it was like it was a struggle, you know, to to find things that I really wanted to get. I just I don't know. I don't know, I really wasn't impressed with their SAS sale this time around. Even though, like I mentioned, I found a few things. But, I don't know. I'm I'm a diehard Yankee person <laughs> uh, as far as candles are concerned. So, I'll probably, you know, give them another visit. If not this weekend, some one day next week. Just to see if anything has changed. And to see if there's anything that I that I want to get. So if you have, um, you know, done a Bath and Body Works or a Yankee haul or whatever, and you know you found some good stuff, you know, leave a comment in the dis um, below. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you picked up. And um, if you have any good candle recommendations, you know, definitely leave a comment below because I can, you know, be on the hunt for those. All right, well, thank you for watching this video, and I will see you next time. Be blessed.